Okay, so this tutorial is going to be teaching you how to do three different kinds of ladders and also how to make some easy straightforward stairs. So start off by having a room with ground and spawn points. Um, if you want to put both, you can. If not, if you're just testing it, you can put one type of spawn. Okay, we're going to create a just a block on the ground that extends all the way across the room and make it tall enough so it's it's kind of like a platform that you're going to be using the ladders to get on top of. Don't make it too tall, but make it maybe taller than the height of a normal person, like so. I'm going to give it a different texture. You can do that by pressing Shift A. We'll give it this, uh, this blue one right here. Make it a little shorter. Okay. Uh, we're going to start off with the easiest of the types of stairs and to do this all you're going to do is just create a texture a texture block and we're going to add a texture to it that looks like a ladder and we're going to add a um, entity to it that makes it climbable so just use your block tool which is over in the toolbar to the left and just create a block that goes from the, the bottom to the top of the um, the giant block you just created, the platform. So I'll make it like that, and then make sure that it only sticks out a tiny bit, so you can do that from your bird's eye view by holding onto Alt, so it doesn't um, s snap to the, the edges. So we'll make something like that, that looks about good. Press Enter, and let's press Shift A, or you can go up to, or you can go to this tool right here, which is the um, texture tool, press browse, and put in ladder. Um, you're not going to see these ones because they're custom ones that I made myself, but you will see this one and this one. Choose one, I'm going to go with the the texture, the dev texture one. Double click, press apply. If you see this where it's backwards, so ladder isn't the correct way, press face. You can do that for any type of texture. If it's facing the wrong way, you can do it like that. Okay, so now we have our ladder, but if somebody were to walk up to this and try and climb it, it, it wouldn't work. So click on it, cr press Control T, or Tools, um, Tie to Entity, go down to Funk, Ladder, and press Apply. Okay, very simple. Now your ladder is climbable, and it works. Watch out when making these, because if they stick out a little bit, the same texture that you applied, this ladder texture, is going to be shown on the left. So what I like to do is press Shift A. So now we have our texture wall up. While holding on to Control, click the front of it. So now you have all the walls selected except for the very front one. Press Browse and press No Draw. Click on the one that's Tools No Draw, not the Tools No Draw roof. Double click, press Apply. So now when people look to the left and right of it, they're not going to see the ladder texture. They're, not, they're just going to see nothing. OK, that's the basic one. Now we're going to use what's called a prop. Very useful if you want to put like trees and stuff like that. But anyways, click on your entity tool, go to your objects on the right, and go down to prop static. So it's going to be right there. You're going to click. It's just going to be this red little box. And let's move it over so it's a little bit further away from our first ladder. Maybe not too far away. Uh, double click on it in the 3D view. Go to World Model. Press Browse. And then put in Ladder. All these different types of ladders that you can use will show up. Um, I'm just going to use a basic one, which is the... Just like a wooden one that I kind of like ladder wood. You can use any of these, but just make sure that it's the correct size because you can't really enlarge and you can't make them larger, you can't make them smaller. They'll be the size that they are created as. So ladder wood, press apply. Now they're going to come out maybe not the way that you wanted them to, so we're going to use our bird's eye view, click on the middle of the object, and we're going to swing it around until it's facing the correct way. And then I'm going to move it, actually it's facing the wrong way. No, 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 that was right. Okay, so we're going to move it towards the wall, holding um, Alt if you want to, 
And then in our other view, our front view, side view, we're going to move it so it is at the correct height. So usually you want your ladder to not go over the top. Just be perfect like that. You can adjust it however you want. Make sure it's not like floating in the middle of nowhere. And there we go. Um, unlike this one, we can't tie an entity to a prop. So what we're going to do is create a block in front of it. In the bird's eye view, just holding um, Alt, create like a little thin sliver. And it should be the same height as the block, as the uh, prop behind it. So click Enter. And then drag it so it's all the way towards our prop. Make sure it's the same width and the same height. It should be, but just make sure. Now you're going to click Shift A or the texture tool, browse, and then press ladder. And it's going to be the very bottom ladder. It's going to tools, invisible ladder. Double click on it, press apply. And then there you go. What this is, is it's an invisible ladder, but it makes it so this orange section can be climbable, but it won't show up when the map is actually compiled. So it's kind of nice. So you can have a weird, um, a weird prop or something that is unusual, and you can make it climbable.